Hello guys, we're at another, another level of the, the mines, and we're with Welshie, we're watching Welshie again, and he just watched me, and I lost at day 15. This will be on the YouTube guys, don't forget to click that like and subscribe, if you are watching, and you're enjoying this content. He's going for a, a very quick stone, as we do know where the location is. I like this, but he's getting a bit too aggressive. Although they're only slow, they could overwhelm him with one mistake. He's got the three houses out, so he's gone straight for some quick expansion. And he's doing a little bit of micro, and he should be able to deal with this quite easily. A lot of tactical pauses. It's like he really enjoys the pause button. A 16 food. It's not too bad. And the houses are in. And he's got the workers. And it's all looking good for Welshie right now. A nice, easy, relaxing game as he knows what his game plan is. And he's definitely executing. And the colony is under attack. And it could be all over right now. Here it is. And here it is. They're coming in. They're coming straight in. It's day, day zero, 19 hours, and they're attacking his main base. They're only, only just dealing with this. Right now, it's panic stations right now. Panic stations. He doesn't know what to do. He's confused. He's panicking. He's getting the walls out. The walls. And he's repairing. Whew. That was a quick, a quick attack from the zombies. Nearly caught him off guard. But he was there to stop it. Great defense from Welshie. But expanding too fast. And he's realized now that it's not the right play. But he's still going for it. He doesn't care, and he's gonna keep going. It's all back. It's all Mill House right, right here. He's gonna expand to the, to the stone real fast. It could have been all over, but right now he's doing all right. A tactical pause with an expansion of the Tesla coil, and he's going for extra houses. All four ranges are at the bottom of the map. Anything could happen right now. This is nail-biting stuff. All it takes is for one, one scratcher. And there he is. He's there again. He's coming back. It's a second attack. And they're not... They're <laughs> Two mistakes in the space of one day and 12 hours. And this is fun. This is extremely entertaining right now. That one mistake has pushed out all the zombies from the north, or should I say west. And it's just really uncomfortable for him. He has to drop one back. He's dropping three back. He doesn't know what he's doing right now. He's scared. <laughs> he's panicking. And he's going to try and deal with this. He realises the noise is just too much. But he's alive. It's day one, 20 hours, and he's still trying to, trying to recover. From that crazy attack that just happened. He's trying to... Oh, there's a 20! A 20 farm! And I'll be remembering that for my next playthrough. <laughs> <coughs> there's an attack on the soldiers. But I think she's going to deal with it. Oof, that was a close one. It's a really good scratch in post. A really good scratch in post placement. It has stopped the attacks. And I think there is no more. This could be a nice slow approach now. As he goes for the quarry. He doesn't have quite enough of the quarry. He needs more wood. He's gone and found an 18 wood. He's going to try and expand his houses. The only problem with expanding the houses is that you've got to try not to go on the fertile land. Because the farms are where they... Oh, 
he's found some more. 1670. He's going for the 17 Hunters Cottage. And I can't complain. I don't blame him at all. And right now, it's all quiet. All quiet on the Western Front. And the quarry is up. Day 2, 17 hours. And that's not a bad time. He's trying to find more. But because he's put down the... Uh, the log cutter, he can't get that 18, that 18 hunter's cottage, which was looking really appealing right now. He's going for some extra houses. He looks pretty secure right now. That, that quick expansion nearly sh shot him in the foot, but he has re recovered really well from it. With 52, oh, he's going for some walls, nice and early on the quarry. Interesting. And he's going to start pushing out towards the east. I like the way he's doing this. He's going to expand out to the east as he knows the horde is coming from the east. If he can stop this attack from the f day 14, he'll be on for a, a very good run indeed. I'm all for him. I'm rooting for him right now, guys. Don't forget, guys, if you are enjoying this video, to click that like and subscribe on Lad TV and YouTube. We're going to be playing... Twitching and moving on to YouTube via export. Nothing like casting a game of They Are Billions. Who would have thought this would be so entertaining, guys? Watching other people lose. I mean, I love it. Right now, there's one small creeper just walking on, and he spotted it. Now, that was a close one. That was a very close one indeed. But he's okay. The walls are under attack. The scratching post is there to save the day again. It's a very good placement on the scratching post. He doesn't cause much attention, and he does survive. If they walk past the scratching post, it's all over. Sometimes that can happen. That's a nice windmill. A good placement for the... He's trying to find more food, but he hasn't really got any space. He's not expanding, he's playing defensive, and he is moving out to the east. And he's got a small little... He's a walker, he's walking in, he's trying to take the Tesla coil, but it's just too slow. He's just too slow. And he shut it down. Great play from Welchy. And he is a bit worried now, he's panicking. He doesn't realise what's going on. He's trying. Ah, he's expanding to the east. So it was a good. It's a good idea to get some extra farms down towards the east. And he does have walls down by the quarry, so he's a good shot. Oof, that is a very, very. He does have a ranger to defend the hunter's cottage, and he's gone for another scratching post. Unfortunately, that scratching post is not as effective as the first scratching post, but that is just an, an unfortunate result there. He can't really push another, wasting more resources to get an extra scratching post. Might not be the play. He would need to get another Tesla coil. He's going for a very quick wood shot. Now, I think that was a mistake. He wanted to go for shocking towers early, which is great, but he also moans like hell that he doesn't have enough soldiers. And right now he's being stretched thin, with patrols everywhere. They're also getting in as well. He needs the extra soldiers, but he's He's looking out. He knows exactly what he's looking for. Just those little creepers walking in. Ah, some more scratching posts next to the log camp. Very nice. And the, he's gone for a quick soldier camp as well. This is very, very good play right here. Day 4, soldier camp and wood workshop. He's got a chance. I really hope he does it. But he's making silly mistakes right now. I don't know if he's going to be able to hold out. What's his next move? I would move out into the east as he knows exactly where the horde's coming from. If he moves out to the east and he gains control of the east, at least he's able to get the shocking towers in a great position. Ah, yes. It is also a bit too early, to be honest, to be getting a soldier's camp. You are right, Hado. It's a close one. It could pay off in the long run. He wants to get... He knows where the... 
He knows where the horde's coming, so honestly, taking it to the east could be a good play. He needs to really commit to either soldiers or a shocking tower. I think he's going for both. His economy just isn't strong enough. Even the viewers know it. He's going for free rangers, okay. He's going to up his production on the rangers, I do like this. But he just doesn't have the economy to get the stone out. He doesn't have the economy, like he doesn't have the power, he doesn't have the food, he's not going for the farms. He has to have one strategy, he's using the food to buy the rangers and now it could be all over. It's day five and he's stuck, his economy is in, the, his, his economy's down. He's either going for one strat or the other, he can't go for both. And now he's moving out. <laughs> Expanding to the north because he realises he's made a mistake. What's he going to go for here? He's trying to find that 18. He's found a 14, but it's too close to the edge. He's already thin. I don't think he should, but he's going to he's gonna try it, maybe. Ah, he's got an extra ranger to hold. This could be a bad mistake. If he holds, if he attracts a horde here, it could be all over. Straight over to the houses. There's no messing around. Okay. Another hunter's call. Oh no, that is the one that he's found. An 18. Oh, it's tight. He's going for the walls again. It was a good strategy last time. You know, that is really ballsy right now if he does that. To the sea to get the extra, extra food. It's a good play. I didn't use it. It is not me, Hado. This is Welsh Warrior. We're watching him. Welcome to the stream, bud. Ah, this is uh, being recorded for YouTube. He's got the extra... He's expanding. Okay, to the north. It's a good play. They only got some slow... Slow zombies in the north. Not many runners. Probably one of the most logical plays, at least, anyway. There is, a, like, a gold mine up there. So maybe is the right play to expand straight to the north nice and nice and quick after you've got the stone. He's at 287 gold per day with 31 production on his logs. It's not too bad. He wants to go for the fisherman's cottages. 14 is easy money, easy food. <laughs> He does know where the horde is coming from, and it is coming from the east. No, he's just he's just rushing through. He doesn't care. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he just got out of it. That was a close one. I... Ah, and now we got a little bit greedy. Went for the old. Well. <laughs> Designs you can't go wrong. I went wrong last time, but I needed to find out where the horde was. He's got. Oh, this this could be a big problem right here. He went greedy, went for the resources, but now he's got some someone knocking on his door. He's trying to get the units out. All it takes is a few runners, and it could be all over. The gameplay is is live. It is live indeed. But the, the YouTube videos are not live. He's got 21 extra food, which is really good, but his power isn't there if he wants to go shocking towers. At day 7, he needs another 7 days. The, the production, the defense, he's dealing with a... Uh, he's, he's, he's got some big problems right here. He's got some runners. They're being killed. Because they can't get through the bottleneck. But all it takes is a few more noise. And you'll be attracting a few more than just just a few runners. And here they come. They've heard the noise. And he <laughs> it's getting a little bit too hectic right now. <laughs> 
<laughs> He's gonna have to bring some extras. And here they come. This could be all over here. They've got some runners. He's gonna have to sacrifice some men. He's not going to. It looks like it could be all over here. It is 800% apocalypse mode. And he's not going to make it to the 14 days. He's going to sacrifice one ranger. Maybe. He can micro both. A nice pause here. A lovely tactical pause. He's trying to move them away. But I think it's too late. They've hit the Tesla coil. And there's some more noise being made. There's only a few runners. He could deal with this. He takes one day. Oh, he's, he's going to ramp up the soldiers. An extra four soldiers. If he sacrifices a few soldiers, moves them away from the, the base, he up, <laughs> moves into more runners. Okay, fair enough. But he is making the move. Of, he's, he's diverting the attention away from the base. But I think it's too late. Three have got in there. Four have got in there. Five have got in there. They keep pushing. There's, he realizes it could be over here. He's walking around. He doesn't have anything apart from rangers right now. It could be GG. Game over. It looks like it's done. Fuck. He's calling it right here, guys. He tried his best, but unfortunately, it just wasn't enough. Welshy, what happened there? I got too greedy. You got too greedy. You went for the resources on the north. And you could have just let him to die, and then, but... I don't know. I think there was more to it than that. What do you think? Got too greedy. All it got is. too greedy. Day seven was that, or day eight? Don't even know. That's right. And don't think you're good. You're rubbish. The cottage research was a mistake. That's what our hacko thinks. Yeah, what I agree. Hate okay. I don't know. I like a cottage research. I like getting the economy up faster, but. You went for too many things at once. You got to go for either the Rangers or the Shocking Tower, but you went for both as well, and you just don't have enough. You don't have enough economy. Your research points is not there. But anyway, we're gonna take a.